Hello, beautiful guys and girls. Um, I just want to give you a quick, quick update on the Uranium ETF, in this case, the URNM, which is the 100% pure play Uranium uh, ETF. Today, getting hammered with basically everything else. You can see here, these are some of the ETFs that I follow. It is just red across the board. We yeah, more or less red all the way over. And uh, yeah, obviously, when the market sells off big time, uranium miners, gold miners, whatever you have, even though they are, you know, instilled in a bullish uptrend, they will not get spared. So I just want to show you some short term stuff and some long term, very important levels in which we currently are. So this video shouldn't take more than roughly three minutes. I want to show you, I want to add a few trend lines on just to give you an idea why I think we are at a very important moment here, at least in the shorter term. Um, again, I will like to point out we are now at the we are now at the 2021 highs again for a second retest. I will zoom in here on the daily so you can see it. So on the second retest here, we are actually right there at that moment in time. Also, if you go to the daily here, you can see here if we add in, we have this rising wedge right here, which now still acts as support, uh, but hopefully we can hold here and then we can add up that line from there. That was the rising wedge, which blew to the upside above the 2021 highs retest. For now retest, we have support. Um, again, we can also go to the weekly here and see if we add on the 30 weekly moving average, it's still coming up heavily here. So again, the momentum is still to the upside. Uh, ideally, we really want to hold. At least we will not close below that level. The level is roughly 51 point, uh, 0.5, 0.6, 0.7, you know, roughly, roughly around there. Very important weekly level to hold. Um, short term, I want to show you the daily stuff here. Uh, excuse me, the one hourly. So we're going from weekly to the daily and now the one hourly. You can see here we had that big breakout here where we gapped up big time and then we came bullish consolidation in toward the retest roughly something like this i'm drawing it very quickly here for you guys um depending on how you want to draw it there or there let's make it there so we had that bull flag in toward the retest boom and then we blasted higher same thing again is actually happening right now as we speak we have that bull flag roughly something like this again I, i'm drawing this very quickly but you can see here we're having the same thing again here. So will history repeat? And we will have that second retest right here and we will go higher, maybe. We will definitely see tomorrow. Uh, or for the remaining of this week, uh, yeah, for Friday, the week closes here. So that makes sense. Uh, I will notice that we have a one, two, three, four, five move down. I guess my count is somewhat correct, even though I would have preferred this one to be a little higher, that retrace. Um, but again, same thing here, same consolidation into what that massive 2021 highs. If that holds for the week, then I will consider that as a big victory here, short term. Um, so yeah, that is basically, basically what I'm looking at. Um, as you can see here, the 30 weekly is still coming up nicely. So we are still, um, in an uptrend on the weekly, uh, you know, some negative divergence here on the RSI between the price and the, yeah, the RSI. But again, I'm not putting that much, much effort into the RSI. I'm just having there as a, like a gauge to look at, but not something that I used really um, in my trading or in my uh, investment. So 51.5.7, maybe that's really key level to hold for the remaining of the week. Uh, we do not want to dip below, especially we do not want to get back below that rising wedge. That would open up a huge can of worms to the downside here. Again, you can you can consider that a buying opportunity, obviously, but uh, I would prefer to stay above. Uh, let's just say we will stay above. So that's all. Very short video. 51.5 really. That needs to hold. Let's see if it happens. Thank you for tuning in, guys. And again, do you agree? Do you disagree? Do you have any other levels? Uh, indicators, whatever you want to use that, you know, is important to you. Let me know in the comments below. I think we are at a critical moment here for the, at least short term, for the uranium miners. This could be like a double fake out here uh, above that 21 highs. Not ideal if we start to, to get below there. So 
Thank you for tuning in, guys. Have a great evening. And uh, we will see you tomorrow. Definitely. Bye.